Doge is testing a major resistance level. And if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. We just made another 43% this week in terms of trading as well as this whole dip opportunity. Our Telegram channel has absolutely killed it. If you guys are still thinking about joining, make sure to check out the hey link. Hey guys, Finger Stretch here. Welcome back to another Doge analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. Now, as you guys can see on Doge, we have hit our bullish target perfectly. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and explain to you guys what exactly happened here but you guys already knew from yesterday's video i mentioned that if assuming we can break above our exponential moving averages and use them as support we could be looking for a very nice retest on this resistance level before a possible continuation to the downside or of course a very large short squeeze opportunity i warned you guys many times that i would not be looking to short doge at this level because of how oversold it was and we actually managed to enter a beautiful 25% trade live as well as ten Telegram. So congratulations to those of you that are part of the channel. Now, of course, the question remains is whether or not Doge will continue rallying or, of course, if this is just another fake out before a stronger continuation. For in order for us to classify this move as a fake out, it's going to be very important from the bearish case scenario to try to break below the exponential moving averages with possibly grabbing liquidity around this range here at 0.073 now from the bullish case scenario assuming we get above this level and actually manage to hold it as support that would mean that the bearish case scenario is now over this would be somewhat of the local bottom formation before we continue rallying towards the upside now for those of you that have been watching my youtube as well as those in the telegram you guys already knew that we were expecting a short squeeze but now this is a very crucial point for crypto overall because of the fact that assuming we don't end up breaking below the 0 0.07 level we could be looking for a much larger short squeeze to happen because of how many shorts were laddered within this range this is exactly why i warned you guys not to be looking for shorts mostly at the, this weekend because of all the volatility that happened during the week as well as the fact that we do have quite a few news updates coming out this month that you don't want to be caught within the wrong position the question of course now becomes is whether or not if this squeeze is going to happen where exactly could the target it go well number one you'll notice on the four hour time frame this 0 0.07 level was of course a very strong resistance point which is exactly a perfect range to be looking to grab that liquidity but assuming that we are of course using weekend volume and this move is manipulated i am going to be very careful looking for buy opportunities the reason I say that is because I would much rather enter a buy once again at 0 0.057 than the current range we are at. In order for me to look for a spot buy, guys, remember spot buying, I would have to find a daily support level that wasn't broken. Right now, we ended up breaking a midterm as well as a daily at 0 0.075 and 0 0.07. And now we are just seeing a nice pullback, but we have seen the same pullback happen multiple times. You guys need to zoom out of the chart and look at Doge from a larger perspective. You can see the last time we ended up seeing a massive move to the downside, we saw the same sort of pullback opportunity grab that liquidity and continued pushing on downwards this to me just looks like another green candle after a sea of red and of course this wasn't really a shock to a lot of you because you guys already knew we were in such over extreme souls conditions and if you guys watch my video from yesterday guess what i pointed out i pointed out the fact that hey look at our nine exponential moving average on the daily time frame look at where doge is sitting i wouldn't be surprised if we managed to see a beautiful liquidity grab at that level this is exactly what i was talking about you notice how doge hit that target perfectly and now we are currently consolidating so this is why i mentioned be very careful looking for shorting opportunities because now that we saw a short squeeze we could be looking for a much larger v-shaped formation to play out if this V-shaped formation does play out, our overall target would remain at the 20 exponential moving average on the daily, which of course is once again at 0 0.075. Even here on the hourly time frame, you'll notice that we were 
seeing a beautiful consolidation zone as soon as we started using our exponential moving averages as support that was the confirmation we were looking for for a beautiful buy opportunity but that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and i hope you guys have a